Mr. Putin's press secretary Dmitry Peskov ruled out a formal meeting and said the best option now would be a conversation on the margins of an international summit. Mr. Peskov said the possibility of Mr. Putin visiting Washington for talks was raised when the two leaders met in Helsinki in the summer. But tensions have since reached boiling point over Mr. Trump's decision to pull put of a key nuclear treaty in Russia's renewed campaign of military aggression against neighboring Ukraine. Dialogue is not working out despite certain plans and certain homework done by both sides, Dmitry Peskov Mr. Peskov said, back then, this possibility was looked at but now it is out of question, no one says a word about it because now general prospects for their next meeting are unclear, critical massive dialogue is needed for that, but now it is lacking, the easiest option is to meet on the sidelines of international multilateral forums. Donald Trump called off talks with Vladimir Putin at last week's G20 image, Getty. Vladimir Putin's official spokesman said talks with Donald Trump were out of the question, image, Getty. The next such event will be held in Osaka. It will be the next G20 summit in six months, and it is an untenable pause both for our bilateral relations and for international security and stability. The Kremlin said it regretted dialogue between Russia and the U.S. was not working out despite what it said was a series of important strategic issues that needed to be discussed. Mr. Peskov said, dialogue is not working out despite certain plans and certain homework done by both sides. Moscow was furious when Mr. Trump called off talks his Russian counterpart at last week's G20 summit in Argentina where the two leaders were scheduled to discuss Washington's stance on the Intermediate Range Nuclear Forces INF Treaty. Mr. Peskov said, we expected this meeting between Putin and Trump, who could have discussed the process in outline ways to a potential dialogue on that topic, but, regrettably, as you know, the meeting never took place, the talks were scrapped as a result of Russian aggression in the Black Sea the previous weekend when three Ukrainian naval vessels were seized and their crews imprisoned. Donald Trump has threatened to pull the U.S. out of the INF Treaty, image, Getty, Mr. Trump said, based on the fact that the ships and sailors have not been returned to Ukraine from Russia, I have decided it would be best for all parties concerned to cancel my previously scheduled meeting in Argentina with President Vladimir Putin, I look forward to a meaningful summit again as soon as this situation is resolved.